my god. <coughs> Hi guys. <coughs> oh shit. <coughs> Hi guys. Hi. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel if you're a repeat offender. If you're new here, my name's Amber and I make videos like these, like plus size hauls. I also make some whack story times. Uh, I would love if you subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell if you want to see more. I don't know if that actually does anything, but just do it in case. <laughs> so today I'm going to be doing like a little plus size Princess Polly review haul. The haul. <laughs> and I'm also going to be crossing that over with a Dolls Kill haul. In the last two weeks I shopped on both of those sites and I didn't really buy enough for either to make like a full haul. You guys seem to really like the hauls that I've done so far. So I thought I would do like a combo. Uh, the Aussie brand versus the American brand. Round two. Fight. Don't mind me. I'll start off with Dolls Kill because... So first off the bat, I got this like flower dress from the brand Delilah's. It's like a silky pattern which I love and I got it in an extra large. The price, I'll put the prices up on the screen just here for you because um, I can't remember how much it cost. But I just, I usually don't like things like these but I just thought it was really cool and looked like, like a very like 90s pattern and colour. So it's got a collar and um, kind of meant to hit like mid thigh and hug your figure a little bit. Uh, I would describe it as kind of like a school dress cut. Now this did not fit well, their sizing's a bit weird. So I got this in an extra large and it still didn't fit, which was really weird because I've bought their 1X size stuff before, like their plus size stuff, and it was way too big for me. So I was rather disappointed with that. So second item I got, now as you'll notice, there's a bit of a theme here with this Dolls Kill haul, but I'll get to that. So, okay, so the next thing I got from Dolls Kill was... The next thing I got from Dolls Kill was, like, this set. Again, I can't remember how much I paid for it. It also comes with, like, this little bra top. The material's freaking awful, just absolute garbage. Like, there's a little crop top, and it's just netting at the back and I bought this just because I thought it would be really cute to have like pants on and have like this sticking up the top so that's how I will be trying it on. I'm keeping to theme of my hauls and I'm accidentally showing you my knickers yet again. It's not gonna support your boobs at all. I'm lucky mine are quite small so this this will do it. So uh, the next thing I got is um, it's this cute button down crop top that's supposed to like reveal a lot of cleavage. And I got it from Current Mood, which is my favourite band on Dolls Kill. Um, I'll button it up for you guys so you can see what it looks like buttoned up. So here's the shirt all buttoned up and it's got a cute little tie. Sorry, I'm like so bad at holding the clothes up. But it's got a cute little tie. I thought it'd be really cute. So I got that from Current Mood. That was also in an extra large. That showed way too much cleavage. <laughs> um, and I couldn't do up the buttons. Um, and it was, it's really, really thin and it's very, very see-through, like. Um, next I got this jacket from Dolls Kill. Um, this isn't one of their, like, n regular brands. It's, like, it's 36.5? 36.5. So it's one of these fluffy Sherpa jackets. It's dark green. It's silk lined. It's got pockets. It's so soft, like I wish you guys could feel it. It's so incredibly soft. It's really, really nice. Um, I thought it'd be nice to film like natural daylight and then the fucking sun had to die. So, um, <laughs> the sun had to die. <laughs> um, yeah, really overcast outside and started raining. So now we've got like this happening. <laughs> yeah, so anyway, I think it's really, really, really nice. It's so fluffy, like, oh, and I know that I'm a year late to the Sherpa trend, but it's not really Sherpa. It's kind of more like fluffy blanket material. I just thought, yes, it's fucking awesome. I freaking love that jacket so much. Uh, it fit great. I think I forgot to say as well, I got it in a size large. So I don't know why these extra larges aren't fitting when that large fit really good. So dolls kill. Help a girl out, okay? Okay, next item I got from Dolls Kill, which again is, spoiler alert, another disappointing purchase. So, I got these shorts, they're Mo Momoko Rom. I don't know what that is. Whatever that brand is. But they're kind of like uh, a canvas 
type thing, but they're very, very, very thin. But they are cute. Uh, you can have a bit of that butt cheek moment if you got that big booty on the bottom. Otherwise, you can be covered. Cause... But yeah, these were not it for me. Um, next item I got was this chain necklace. Yeah, so I got this chain necklace. That's how it closes. You open this. Um, I they I. I feel like on the website they were selling it as a necklace, but it is a chain for your pants. You can wear it as a necklace too. It's a little bit long, but I'll put that on now. You can't really tell that I've got it on. It's pretty long. There it is on. You can also like double it, wear it around twice, but I think with my laid necklaces, I'll just wear it the one. I feel like I like this, but it was overpriced. I also have like a Depop one that I'll show you now. I got this one on Depop, like this is another pants chain, or you can wear it as like a two chain necklace, which I have um, might have done in one of my videos prior, you might have already seen this, but I got this from Depop and I just think it was awesome and I paid like $8 for it. And I know it's not as long as this one, but it is a double chain, so I feel like it kind of equals out. Um, you can wear it this way too. So it's, it's only about three centimeters shorter than the other one. But honestly, I just think this one is the exact same quality and it was a lot cheaper on Depop. So if you have Depop, I would recommend buying it on there rather than getting this one from Dolls Kill. Again, everything will be linked down below that I've bought. Honestly, I'm just roasting Dolls Kill. Like, I've probably shot there at least like 10 massive purchases. Like when I do buy from there, I like to spend, you know, like $150 plus. So I get um, free shipping. I still buy like little things here and there. But honestly, I always buy like a lot from there. And I've spent probably thousands of dollars on there. And I've never ever got this amount of things that are just shit. Like they're just shit. Like they're just shit quality. And they do not fit. And I'm really upset. And the last thing I got from Dolls Kill was um, some laces. I have shoe laces for my dog months. So I've already put them into my shoe um, when I got my package a couple days ago. Just to show you how they look. And I think they look really, really nice actually. Um, so that's it from my Dolls Kill section of this try on. And now I'm going to move on to Princess Polly. Now I only bought three items from Princess Polly. I did buy a Jeffree Star liquid lipstick in the shade Red Rum. That's in my car and it's raining outside so I'm not going to go get it. So here's, I'll um, just put a picture on screen of that lovely shade. I think it's awesome. Um, great same formula as all the other lipsticks. Let's start with something I actually liked. So um, first item I got was this Eight Birdies um, in a medium to large. So like two sizes and one. And it's this god that looks small. It actually stretches out quite nice, but it is super short. It didn't look that short on the model, but unfortunately, um, very, very short of me. But it's just like a high neck, long sleeve dress. Um, it's ribbed. I'll show you up close. Yeah, it's ribbed. Um, thick material. Uh, really, really comfy. Unfortunately, it's short. It's 100% too short for me. But I do really like it and it's just shame because um, it's really good quality like and it's stretchy and it's just com comfortable to wear. I bought this dress because I wanted to wear it for one of my Halloween costumes. Um, and I'm not going to spoil my Halloween video because I did film a makeup tutorial for it which is super fun. But I bought this dress for the costume and so as soon as it arrived in the morning I started filming the video. So I got this cute little frilly jumpsuit. I love it. Um, it has these straps that can go on the shoulder or down the shoulder. Um, it was quite expensive. Uh, broke the bank, I'm not gonna lie. But as you can see, it looks super cute on. Uh, looks, it looked look nice with like a chunky black belt, but I couldn't find one to like try it on with. But yeah, I really love it. It's got like these cute little white, uh, white spotty details. As you can probably see, like all these little dotty details. And it's just like, it's supposed to be like kind of wrinkly and cute. And it's got this stretchy band around your waist just to like bring you in. And But this is super cute. But back to my story of how I ruined this the first day I got it. So you can't tell on camera because my lighting's really bright. But I spilled freaking tomato sauce. You literally cannot even see the stain in a size uh, Oz 14 and it fit perfect. I probably even could have gone down a size just to suck me in just a tiny bit more because again it is quite stretchy so I could probably have uh, gone with a 12 which is r rare for me to say with Princess Polly because usually their stuff's like really tight like the green dress but yeah um 10 out of 10 for this 
jumpsuit. I absolutely freaking love it. It's can't wait to find something to wear it out to. Yeah, so that will conclude today's video. I hope you enjoyed uh, my two little, like, cross track hauls. Um, overall, again, very hit and miss <laughs> with the sizing. Like, I just, I don't know. <laughs> like, everything that I bought, I will link down below for you. If you want to buy any of it, I would not recommend the uh, white top that I got on Dolls Kill or the white shorts. Um, unless you want like a cute little bit of a see-through moment. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, don't forget, don't forget to... <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe. Am I even saying that right? Bye. I don't know why I said it like that. Diga. <laughs>